Welcome to Let's Play Forza Motorsport 4, part 155, and it's Super GT time. So for a finale of the uh, Asian manufacturer events, we're going to be uh, doing our only uh, race car, our only R-Class series. And it's going to be the Nissan Super GT showcase. Little we'll just Nissan race car. So if I wanted to, if I really, really wanted to, I probably could have entered the R390 into this. But that doesn't fit the theme of this series, so I'm just going to stick with the uh, Super GT car. And we got four races, and let's get started at Motegi. Okay. That was awful. I mean, reaching the end of lap one, still in seventh, is usually pretty awful. I tried to get a slightly better launch by shifting early into second gear. Didn't really help. Excuse me, sir. Ah, damn it. Alright, well, I got damage. So, now the real fun begins, aka my car's not gonna drive as well. I'm just overall not used to driving race cars right now. So I've been driving fucking production cars for a very long time. Especially B class cars. Now here I am in fucking Super GT 500. Some of the fastest race cars there are. At least I'm doing a lot better here. I'm actually up to fourth instead of being stuck in seventh behind Watsonabe. Who I just could not pass for some reason. But, I don't know how good my chances are of passing these three. If I even have a chance. Just gotta slipstream as much as I can, because these things. You punch a pretty big hole in the air, so slipstream is pretty effective for these cars. No drag race with Yoshida. Come on, get a little, get a little toe from Takahashi. Help me out. Oh, come on. No. Okay, up to the podium. Two to go, with one to go. No oh, breaking late. Just so I wouldn't have Yoshida dive underneath me. That yeah, probably cost me some time. Take something insane and probably really stupid to win this. You know what that means. The ultra retard dive, probably. If I can even get close enough to do that. So far, uh, not looking too good. Exit of this turn is fucking super important. Ooh, ooh, big slide from uh, Takahashi. Small slide from me. No, Takahashi's looking. Contact. It's gonna help me out, because that holds him up a little bit. Yep, gotta go for it. Bump and run. Go. Dump and run. Suck it. It's just a light bump, you know. No big deal. Okay, a little bit of a bump and run win. I'll take it. That was intense. That was fucking intense. Alright. We have three more to go, so ha. Huh? 
right, and race two brings us to Sonoma for the first time in a very, very long time. God, it's been a long time since we've been to Sonoma. We get to do three laps around the uh, IndyCar course. So here we go, holy shit. So here we go. Pile in turn two here. Okay, so far so good. Oh, yep. Ah, uh, the good old turn three overtake. Every single game that has this track just has that opportunity for me. Every single fucking game. And it always works, too. The best part. Things are going a lot smoother than Motegi so far. That's right, we stay on the drag strip in the Indy Car course. Oh, fuck, hi, how you doing, you, uh, Takahashi? Thank you for the damage. Appreciate it. Oh, God. Climbing up on curbs. Visibility is kind of limited. So, you know, I think I just sh fucking short shifted to hell and back up to fifth. Okay, a little bit of front end damage. It's about as much as I had at uh, Motegi, so it shouldn't hurt me too much. Motegi's in the in any indicator. Also, the speedometer in this thing's measuring wrong. Should be measuring in kilometers an hour, but oh well. Tiny nitpicks. Okay. Two laps to get around Sasaki. My favorite preferred view? Uh, probably interior view. Like, Chase Cam's really nice, and I've grown to like it over the few years that I've used it. Because I used to be exclusively like bumper cam or hood cam, until I realized, okay, you know what? For the entertainment of others, I should probably like make the car noticeable seeable. And I started doing that, and I just kind of learned how to drive with the chase camera, which I could not do in the past. It's actually becoming my preferred view. But I like using an interior view for the immersion, and plus it just adds some fun factor. I don't know. It's the fun kind of immersion. But if I go into, like, super try-hard mode, like super try hard mode. I'll use like a hood the hood camera or, or something similar. Cuz like that's where I get the best view of like all my apexes and lines and stuff. So honestly, it depends on how I'm playing. If I'm just having a grand old time, I'll use, you know, third person camera, or chase camera, if I want the extra little immersion factor, I'll use the uh, in interior cam, and if I want to fucking hot lap like a motherfucker, I'll uh, use the bump, uh, not bumper hood cam. Okay, pulling away. We're in very good shape here. I'm actually surprised this is a three lap race. I was expecting it to be two laps. Hey, it works for me. It's been a while since we've been to Sonoma, so I'll gladly take three laps around here. Now, ooh, Sato's up to fourth, okay. That's not as impressive as, like, I think it is, because Sato starts fifth. Does he start fifth? Yeah. So, like... He, well, he passed two AI cars, I, I guess. I don't fucking know. I don't know, man. Let's just make it around the chicane. It's a very, very tight chicane. This is a very, very tight hairpin. It's even tighter than, like, the hairpin at the actual end of the straight, which is a little surprising, because that's a pretty tight hairpin. 
Oh, there we go. That was a pretty easy race. All things considered. That was just a pretty easy race. I won by four seconds, so, you know. So, we're ready. Two down, two to go. In our Asian finale. Alrighty. Attempt number three? Yeah, this is attempt number three. I thought this was, that was my first attempt. Nope, this is attempt. That was attempt number two. Okay, anyways. Catalonia yet again. Just need to drive a little more efficiently this time. The most hated tracks uh, in Forza. Um. Um. Oh, crap, okay. Three wide does not work at Catalonia. Somehow I got the best of that. I'll take it. Well, both me and Sato, I guess. Although, I did not escape without damage. Uh, most hated tracks in Forza. I'm trying to think. Don't really like the Rio track in Forza 6. I thought the Forza 1 Rio track was a lot better. Well, a lot more fun, at least. Um... I don't know. I don't like the Catalonia School Circuit. I know it's not an original track, but... That's just because... I don't know. Races are so goddamn hard around there. Uh... I don't know, because, like... I like most of the tracks that are in Forza. Like, almost all of them. I can't really think of ones I don't like. <clears throat> Alright, Takahashi. Hopefully I, I'm a little more efficient in actually passing you this time. Can you please stop sliding your car for a moment so I don't risk ramming into your ass. That'd be nice. And that slipstream. I'm absolutely going for a turn one dive here on Takahashi. And I failed. Because oversteer. Oh no, 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 no. Damn it. Let's get back up. Okay, maybe we can set up something out of this next left-hander. So I usually can get a good run out of here. Or just cut the turn like a jackass. And be shit. Probably should have just stayed in fourth gear. Hey, guess who's driving like trash garbage right now? Sure is me. Super dive, hello. I'll take. Okay. <laughs> Fuck. Well, I'll take my Scotty award. God damn it. If only we weren't so goddamn close to Sasaki, that would have been a much less terrible dive. I was just wanting to get around Takahashi. I didn't want to wreck Sasaki. Fuck. You know, for someone who tries to race clean, I sure do a lot of that shit. Ah, <laughs> oh, damn it. Damn it, damn it, damn it. I don't know. The deed is done. The race is won. Let's go to the finale. After another Finny level up. Okay, so what have we learned from attempting this race? Kato's an asshole. That's about it. Just fucking rams into my side in turn one. Boy. Better notice that I'm here this time, bitch. He was, he was still kind of pushing me. Towards the grass, but whatever.
Somehow I'm in fourth. I have no idea how the fuck I managed to do that. Not gonna complain though. Hey, Harry. I don't think there's a minimum amount of bits you can donate. I think you can, like, just donate one bit or something. I don't know. I don't know how it works. Oh, shnikes, okay. Okay, well, there's some separation behind me, so that's good. That means I don't have to worry about getting ass jacked. For now. I'm roughing the shit out of Yoshida here. Nope. Got him. Finally gave up. And then I almost got ass jacked because I broke way too early. Ah, oh, fuck. Well, that was awful. Holy crap. No mechanical damage somehow. Okay, I'll take it. I will take it. much time as possible for 130R. Don't think I really did. Can these two, like, stop pulling away? That'd be nice. Really appreciate that. Alright, well, big-ass gap to Sasaki and Takahashi here. Just try to close as much as I can through the S's. Close gap a little bit. Not as much as I was hoping. I was hoping I'd get right on Sasa or Takahashi's ass, but no. I am now, though. Hairpin dive? Hairpin dive. Hello, world! Okay, and I didn't lose too much time to Sasaki with that dive, thank god. Ah, uh, that's okay. I'm making up for it. Great. Oh, the curbs. Okay, well, retard dive is the only way. The question is, will I be close enough for it? Depends on how much time I gained here. Holy crap, okay. Retard dive not needed. Just normal dive. I took a big risk trying to carry that much speed through 130R. I'm so glad the car stuck. That delicious Super GT downforce working for me there. That was nice. <laughs> that was nice. Alrighty. That was fantastic. Ooh, level 90. Heck yeah. 10 away from 100. Oh shit, it doesn't matter, but nah. So there we go. That was the uh, Nissan Super GT Showcase, our final uh, Asian manufacturer races. So with that... Next time on Forza 4, we'll be going to America for our final manufacturer race section. Stay tuned for that.